Hi, this is Peter Morgan from the DJPodcast.com. In this video for Wing Sound, we're going to be looking at how to use effects inside of Tractor Pro 2. First, you want to assign an effects unit to the particular deck you want to affect. In this case, we want to use FX1 on deck A. All we have to do is click 1, and now we've assigned FX1 to deck A. Next, you're going to want to go and click the on button, as this will actually turn the effect on but you still won't be hearing any of the effect in your mix. You want to adjust the wet dry knob to then bring the effect into the mix. When the knob is all the way to the left, you won't hear any of the effect, and when the knob is all the way to the right, you'll hear all of the effect. You can use the effect parameter controls here to the right to adjust how the effect sounds in your mix. If you want, you can use multiple effects and route them to multiple decks. So for example, if you wanted to use Effects 2 on Deck A as well, you could simply turn that on. You can also send multiple effects to multiple decks by assigning them to Deck B, C, or D. For more complicated effects, you can use a group of effects, as seen here on the top right. Group effects allow you to use up to three effects all at one time, and will allow you to create dynamic buildups and breakdowns to take your DJ mixes to the next level. Check out more of my videos at thedjpodcast.com. Join the conversation by following Wink Sound on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube to keep up with everything you need to know about music and audio technology.